you were right, the clock is broken. You can fix it, right? Of course, just a second. Oh. Hello, I'm back. I'm back with another episode of Day. Uh, oh my god, <laughs> I'm sorry. I got uh, mixed up with things. Another episode of Frambo. It is me, Panchi, and I'll be your guide through this madness. So, in the last episode, we managed to escape from the twins. Uh, it was really hard. Uh, the puzzles were really t tricky, but we're ready for more. So, Fran fell, uh, fell from... Um, what is the name? Uh, from from a... <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, whatever. Fran fell and almost died. And here's Mr. Midnight and we're going to go. Let's go. We're now playing as Mr. Midnight. Franz shoe. Franz dress. Is this dress? Ah, what an ugly tree! I scratch you, evil thing. It's a tree with eyes. Kitty? Kitty, stop it! <laughs> what are you talking about? Uh, about you, I guess. Fran, my darling, is that you? It can be. It is. It is. You're seeing it with your own two kitty eyes. What is it, my dear? Of course it's me. Who else would it be? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Fran, you're a tree. Yeah, you're a tree. <laughs> Don't be silly. Help me get up. Fran doesn't believe it. It's it, Well, it's unbelievable. Wait, just a second. Where are my hands? Why can't I move? Because you're a tree, Fran. You're a tree. I'm telling you, my dear, you have become a tree. Yeah, that's what I'm telling. What? But how? Oh, my dear, this was the end of the line. Everything, everything happens to Fran. I swear to God, she has the worst luck. Or maybe she's cursed, but whatever. Everything happens to her. The big monster did this. I know it. Kitty, he will let us go home. I hope he won't come back. He was very scary. Yes, he was. He always comes back. He has beef with a 10 year old. Of course he will come back. I think I remember him from that night. That night, mom and dad died. Kitty, I don't want to talk about it. I just want to go home. But you are a tree, my friend, a tree. <laughs> Let it be clear, Fran is a tree. Oh my God. Wait. Sorry. I can't carry you all the way back home. Besides, I'm not sure where are where we are either. Am I going to die, Kitty? Tell me. No. Just ju 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 you're just a tree. Please don't say that, Fran. Don't leave me. But I feel so weak. Oh. A that's that's a that's a carrot. It says. <laughs> Homka <laughs> Igni mi Hola Kolke Kolke Ig Runma Pasgu Hola Ni Why is so funny? I don't know. Uh, uh, ig Igni Joke. <laughs> <laughs> Igni joke <laughs> Banti <laughs> I don't know why it's so funny for me, but it's so funny. Oh my god. <laughs> ah be careful sir. Why are you attacking me? Could you please tell me where I am, sir? Hula <laughs> Kolke <laughs> Hula <laughs> Stop it, I'd scratch you <laughs> Every time they talk Oh my god 
<laughs> Hola, run maigni. Why are they saying, oh my kitty, why is this happening to us? Oh my god, this is chaos. <laughs> Hula, stop attacking me, please. I mean no harm. She's just a tree. He keeps going. Kitty, help me. Find my purse, please. Maybe I can do something about this. I'll see what I can do, Fran. Okay. Stop attacking my friend, carrot. I can't really understand what you're saying. Okay. These are front stockings. What about the boat? This is a wooden boat. I know vegetables sitting on a boat. Okay, let's go. What is this? Oh, I'll take this stone. It's shiny. Oh, there is a purse. I see my friend's purse. Okay. Let's go. Oh. It says, I have seen similar mechanics. They circulate. Okay. Okay, okay. Yeah. Oh no. No, put it. No, put it. Put it. Put it. Put it. Yeah. Me that's being an engineer. Oh, I got the purse. I got the purse. I got the purse. Friend, I got your purse. Sorry, I'm be you're being poked. From a darling, I got the purse. That's amazing. You're the best, Mr. Midnight. Now show the sir who is attacking me my family picture. Maybe he understands what a human is. Well, I really hope he does. Uh. Ooh. I got this book. I got a knife. Use. We vegetable. Oh, oh, anum. Niha, niha ka. Ah! Druma, baskin old. It's too funny. It's too funny. Huh? Where are you taking me, sir? Vegetable. <laughs> They want to help you, Fran. I can feel it. Uker, Ruma, Epo. Don't be afraid, my friend. So you feel it. What if they don't want to help us? Kitty, stop them, please. Don't leave me. I will be right here with you. Galopma. Gal <laughs> it's so funny to me. I don't know why. <laughs> well, this was really pretty. The scenery was really pretty. Uh, yeah, we escaped that. Chapter 3. Vegetative state. Chapter 3, everyone. Are you ready to be confused by the puzzles and shit? I am very ready. In medbol meno kaist be siarni haula oanum. What kind of language is that? Irishmao, iptem, gorska, emitan ulfriol. Gorska <laughs> Seattle Okay Welcome creature My name is Siar Do you speak human? Oh my goodness, yes So English is human What about Spanish? What about Japanese? What about Portuguese? German What about those languages? Are, aren't those languages human? Anyways, oh my goodness, yes, finally, words I understand. My good friend Ryde told me that you showed him an illustration with four humans and a cat. I assume you're one of them, the little girl. Please forgive my good friend if he scared you. We have never seen a human looking like a tree before. Can we please let me explain? Let's ask for help. Help me please, I'm a girl. Oh ho ho ho, no need to speak my child, the seed will show me everything. What seed? 
ipten monakais ecto ecto bro bro ecto <laughs> ecto prote okay oh <laughs> did that hurt wow hmm let me see you are good no doubt about that a seeker of the truth very common of the bow family tree ah your name is fran you're the girl with the passion for life i see great love towards this little creature standing next to you ah a cat protector of gates interesting you can see all that in a seed be quiet bitch i'm reading I see something else. The seed doesn't hide anything. No? <laughs> I see a world nobody should see. Nobody except for one. You're making me dizzy. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean by except for one? You mean the monster? You're not supposed to be here, Fran. That is the only thing I can tell you, my child. Ah, you were really talkative at the beginning and now you can't tell me the truth? Stupid tree? Can you help me? I want to go home. Uh, I, can you help me? I understand, but can you help me then? We can't let you leave now. It's too dangerous for us. You should never have been aware of our existence. There must be a way. Am I dead or something? Dead? What do you mean by that? You know, when you no longer exist so death is a lack of existence or not existing anymore anyways death is nothing more than the absence of love besides i'm not a normal tree i must be dead death is nothing more than the absence of love oh that's poetic once you can't feel love you die even if your body still walks uh help me get back home then I'm not dead. You have to help me get back home. Little cat, come closer. Let me see you. What is your name? Aw, my name is Mr. Midnight. That's such a great name for a cat. That is indeed a very pretty name. Do you think Frank should go back home? Yes, I do, sir. Show us the way back home. I implore you. Oh, he's so sweet. Ah, I have a question. Are you the king? Ha ha ha! Ha! You are hilarious. Yes, I am the king. Why, is, why was that funny? <laughs> yes, I am the king. The king of Etherstar. Etherstar. That's what. That's how the place is called then. Oh, what an honor, your highness. By the way, I like your leaves. They are pretty. Oh, it's so sweet. Please, will you help me? I really need to go home. Let's go with the soft way, of, soft way of asking for help. King, sir, please, will you help me? Why is this need of you going home so great? The seed told me your story. You don't have much to go back to. There are many reasons, sir. But the most important is my aunt. She will protect me. I want to feel that somebody cares about me. Oh, I feel confused almost all the time and I want to be someplace where I feel at home, sir. I see, you're very brave. I just want to go home, please help me. There are things I cannot do, but I will help you. I will lead you to the door that will take you home, but it's your own task to walk through it. Really? Oh, thank you so much. And where's this door, sir? We'll talk about that later. First thing first, you must be able to talk and walk on this land. Yes, sir, that would be very great. I'm afraid I won't be able to bring your human body back. Only the great wizard can do that. But we'll talk more about him after the procedure. You must first understand our language. But how will I ever understand your language? Eat this shit! Ew! <laughs> Ew! Fred, you just, you just ate someone, an old tree, pat! Ew! 
know. Your ears and tongue will be able to understand, but not your eyes. That means you won't be able to read. Don't worry about that. I can always ask. Excuse me, do you understand what I say, human lady? Yes, I do, and you're so, so kind. This is incredible. Did you understand, my kitty? I didn't. Your Highness, I demand one fruit for myself. Give the cat a fruit. You don't need the fruit. Oh, you stinky motherfucker. You don't need the fruit, 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 Mr. Midnight. Our land is based on fragrances and sound. You'll see everything as your own world very soon. No doubt about that. You'll do fine, kitty. And sir, do you know why I became a tree? Yes, but I don't think I'm the right one to give you the answers. Now, it's time for the procedure. Are you afraid of heights? Uh, a little yes, depends on the height. Depends, well, it depends on the height. Why? Take her upstairs immediately. Let's go upstairs. Ooh, a bug, a giant bug. Why are you ta ta taking me? What, what are you going to do to me? To get some arms and legs. Everything will be fine. I'll be waiting for you, friend. I love you. I love uh, the bond. I love the bond that Fran and Mr. Marina have. It's so beautiful. It, it, it's it, it's so uh, uh, unique and strong. I love them both. I want them to be happy. What is that? Ooh, an ex ex axolotl axolotl axolotl. I don't know how to pronounce that. Good day. My name is Palon Tras, and I'm your doctor today at your humble service. So he's a doctor. Are you the emergency case? Whoa, amazing. What a huge, beautiful, fluffy thing. Excuse me? How did you call me? Oh, I'm sorry. It's just that I've never seen anything like you before. I'm still trying to understand that all of this is real. My name is Fran. I'm a human girl. The king sent me here to get some arms and legs so I can go home. Oh, a human. I think we can get you a pair of arms and legs, but we'll have to travel a little bit further in order to fix that. Are you ready to enter the paws of the beast? What paws? What beast? <laughs> me. I'm the beast. Let's go. <laughs> That's cute. He must be very soft. Very fluffy. Wow. This is beautiful. Wow. Here we are. Wow, this place is so beautiful and peaceful. I wish I could be here forever. Thank you. This is my home. This is where I was born. The spirit of the great Palocas created. Who's the great Palocas? It has the purest water in the whole universe. Oh wow, that sounds amazing. When do we start? I want to know about the Great Balocas. Who's the Great Balocas? Balocas. Haven't you heard about the five realities? He is the king of the first reality. A long time ago, he was at war with the darkness, and one day he fell. He fell so badly, he has he heart his heart was broken. He was all alone. But he came to Etherstha, and his blood made this water pink. That is why it's so pure. It's a very long story. Oh, that sounds grand. I mean, I didn't know about all the realities. And, oh my god, they keep messaging me. Sorry about that. And how is that you're here? What brought you to Etherstha? My kitty and I were on our way back home. I was so happy to see him and hug him again, but then we fell. My phone just vibrated. The big monster that follows me did this. He broke the bridge. He wants me dead. Who would like to see you dead? That sounds terrible. I prefer not to talk about this. But Sir Doctor, do you know why I became a tree? Yes. Sometimes our wishes are so strong that they become true. So Fran did... So so Fran wished to be a tree. You did this in order to keep yourself alive. Think about it this way. Your human body was destroyed. But you wanted to keep being Fran. You wanted to keep your life. So you took on this empty shell to maintain all your precious memories with you. It is actually the first time I've seen a human using a tree as a chrysalis. 
Did I pronounce that right? Never mind. But it's dangerous to have you here. It makes your land vulnerable. I did this to myself. Wow. But Palantras, sir, how? I didn't know I was doing anything. You really didn't know what you were doing? I see. Well, when you traveled to Ethersta, you opened a door between your reality and ours. And with this door open, unexpected creatures can also enter, enter our reality. And if that happens, the balance will be tainted. And there is only one who would like to poison the second reality. The monster. The terrible black. Oh, he's crying. I can't see this happening again. I just can't. Don't be sad, doctor. I'm very sorry for what I did. I didn't mean to. Oh, little girl, you are so nice. And you don't have anything to be sorry for. I think you're very special. But let's concentrate on your arms and legs, all right? Mm, yes, doctor. Okay, this conversation was really sweet. <laughs> the doctor was really sweet all the time. I love this game. Soldier of the sun, spirit of the water, give front her arms and legs. How do you flee, feel, Fran, for me, Thirsta? Wow, I feel like a beautiful tree. I have leaves. I'm glad you like it. I told you we will fix it. This water is magical. It can fix anything. Anything? Do you think it could fix my mommy and daddy? What do you mean? Fix them? What's wrong with them? Nothing, doctor. Thank you very much for helping me. Oh, you are the very... You're the best doctor I've ever had, and you're fluffy and beautiful. <laughs> I had another doctor before. His name name was Dr. Dean, but he was an ev evil old man. Yes, he was. An old man. Hmm. I bet he wasn't that bad. Maybe he was just following the rules. Let's go now. I'll leave you at the station. What station? I, re I, I also want to climb on that fluffy thing and fly on the sky and not care about anything in the world his tongue is purple here we are again show sire the king what a nice ether stanized you've become thank you again doctor you have to meet my kitty someday that will be lovely i'll see you soon goodbye bye bye okay look at us Woo! we have legs and arms and uh leaves as hair we're we're like a we're like a tree person, like an Ethersta person. <laughs> you fluffy kitty. Oh, do you like that? <laughs> I love this. He's putting the kitty. I will do that too. So I can blame you, King. Here I am. Fran, my dear, you've got leaves on your head. How pretty. Oh, let me see you. What a great Ethersanize you've become. Thank you, King, sir. The doctor is incredible. He made magic with the water. But he was sad. He told me many things, but I didn't quite understand. Oh, my baby. She's a kid. I I, I, I want to say this. Uh, Fran is going through so many stuff, and he, she's trying to understand what's, what's happening to her. And she's only 10 years old uh, she has like a limited uh, knowledge of things and and uh, she has an, a limited understanding of the world so it must be really hard for her she's very brave and strong uh, I like her a lot as a uh, as a main character don't worry Palantras will be fine I know the reasons we have some problems to solve but that's nothing you should worry about let's talk about how you can get back home right Yes, please. You said something about a great wizard. Yes, the great wizard is the only one who is able to bring your human body back. And he has the stones that can open the door that will lead you home. Where is the wizard? What stones? This land is full of things. I don't understand. Ha, <laughs> you haven't even gone outside this castle and you already want to know everything? That's the passion I was talking about. Have patience, Fran. The great wizard lives in the great mountain Kotrim, but we haven't seen him for a while now. Find him and everything will be just fine. But haven't you tried to find the great wizard yourself? 
Well, we don't need to. It's very logical. You need, you see, we don't need a wizard to perform magic or prepare potions. We can do that ourselves. The wizard's most valuable task is to protect the stones that open the door. I see. So the stones are like keys. And what is this mountain you said? You have to ask around. Follow the signs. I have to go now. But I'll be back in time to help you with the door. Have a great Thursday day and good luck finding the great wizard. Oh. He left. Wow, did you see that huge fluffy creature, cre kitty? That's Pelontras. He fixed me. Yes, it's a... It's certainly very fluffy. Oh, I forgot. Here's your purse. Yay, we got a purse back. Oh, thank you, kitty. Did you see my pills anywhere? I don't think so. Maybe they are on the other side of the lake, next to your clothes. Mm, well, we don't have other things to do anyways. We have to find a wizard. Yes, the king said something about a mountain too. Yes, mountain Cotran. The great wizard lives there. Let's go. Mucho texto. Let's keep going. What is in there? No, no. You can't get in. It's closed. What's behind this passage? Sorry, I just want to, want to see what's behind this passage. Well, the library, of, of course, but it's closed. Come back in fall or winter, then it will be open. Hey, aren't you the talking tree I took to see Palontras? Yes, that's me. Palontras gave me arms and legs. Yes, and also a head that is very positive. Hee hee. Hee hee. Yes, but why is the library, library curl, sir? Well, that's logic. As the sun goes around the second floor moon of the third star, we open. Only then the real knowledge will be learned. But that only happens in fall and winter. Oh, so you don't learn anything while you're in summer or spring? Of course we learn. We learn all the time. I'm learning now that you like to ask many questions. Well, I'm curious. That's why everything looks so different here in Ithersta. I guess you're not from around here. Well, I hope to see you soon. Yes, thank you, sir. Bye. I want to enter the library. This is very pretty. <coughs> oh, another bug. <coughs> I'm sorry. Hmm, the flag is waving very, waving hard, very hard. Hello to you. Oh, wow, I don't understand. It's a tree symbol, but I wonder what it says. I can always ask. Okay, what? It says, hello, sir. Are you a guard? Yes. Oh, I see. Do you know where Mountain Cotram is? Yes. Where is? Can you tell me where is it? Yes. <laughs> well, tell me, please. Mm, the mountain country is only in winter time. Winter time? What are you talking about? Mm, of course, winter time. What do you think? But I can wait for winter time. Oh, you don't wait for it. You go there. Go? Oh. But how? Oh, sorry, but I'm not good at explaining things. Go down the stairs and then straight. You'll find a clockmaker. He can explain things. I think he tried with me before. All right. Thank you, sir. Oh, kitty, this land is very different. Do you understand the language already? Yes, I actually understood what the guard told you. I hope we find the clockmaker soon so we can go to Monte Carlo. Okay, let's go.
I want to check on on everything. So many fish. They seem to be here in a hurry. Where are you all going? Are you going home? I wish I could go home too. Okay. What is this? The beautiful paper swirls. A boat. This is the ground. Very big tree. I think that's the castle. That's Palantra's home. A mountain. Okay. We saw a map. The library and the palace. There's a tree. Uh, mountain and that. And it, that seems to be the way to the market. A mountain, a tree, and a little water. It must be the woods. That's the way to the castle and the library. Okay, we kind of know our way. Let's go here. He told us to go this way to find the clock worker. Oh, this is pretty. It's a good day for... For good fabric and thread, I'm at your service. Cute. Hello. Ah, uh, who is there? Who? Me, Frank. Can't you see me? Oh, no. I see a little. You have four eyes. Wow. Four eyes? I don't have... Uh, what are you selling? Only the best plobas of this entire land. Do you want to smell it? Sure, they look like coconuts. It's poo, mees. Poo that I collect. <laughs> they are not coconuts. Poo, like in the toilet. <laughs> wow, I thought it was really bad to eat poo. Bad? Why? It's very yummy. We, lo we love to eat it here. It makes everything grow and shine. Hee <laughs> hee. I have to get going now. Good luck with the plovers. Bye. Okay, let's talk to this one. Oh, he has muscles. Hello, I'm Fran. What are you doing? Good day, I'm Pruder. And I'm molding this piece of iron. For what? I have to deliver a few clock pieces to the clockmaker. You make all kinds of stuff? Oh, see, I see. You can do all kinds of metallic stuff. Sure, if you have some ideas, we can talk about them. And badam, I do it. That's very good to know. Thank you, sir. Well, I have to keep working. But if you need my services, you know where I am. All right. I want to talk with everyone because... Um, oh, this is a cool worker. Because people give you uh, important pieces of advice and clues about what you have to do. Hello, miss. I think you have very beautiful fruits. Thank you, dear. Would you like some? Oh, no. I'm on a mission to go back home and I want to be hungry when I get there. Oh, so from what part of Ithersta are you? Are you from outside of the island? No, I'm not from Ithersta at all. I'm a human. Oh, a human. That's new. Well, I hope you complete your mission. Thank you, miss. I certainly will. See you. Okay, this part of the game, I love it. Everything is beautiful. Everyone is so nice. I, I like it. I like it here. Hello, what are you doing? Mm, working on my clock. Oh, I see. I see. <laughs> Sir, do you know where I can find the great wizard? No, miss. I do clocks. I fix clocks. I listen to clocks. Tick tock. Mm, and do you know where the mountain cottram is? The mountain cottram only exists in winter time. Otherwise, it's just a regular mountain. I can't wait for winter. The king said that the wizard will be in the mountain cottram. You don't need to wait for winter to come. That's absurd. Time is an infinitely layered reality. <laughs> Tell that to a 10 year old. Oh, a layered reality. That sounds great. What should I do then? Go to the big clock and change the season. Just change it. Where is the clock? Well, go towards the castle, but turn to your left when you see stairs. You'll find a big clock on the tree. Good luck. Thank you, sir. 
say thank you, sir. Wait. Wait, I'll be right back. Two hours later. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, I had to reply to some important messages. I'm still closing um, the semester uh, with my final evaluations and shit. So I'm kind of wor um, um, worried and also busy, but uh, uh, it will be over soon. So yeah, let's keep going. Hello, lady. Is there any news? Good day. Would you like to read the newspaper? I can read Ether's. Uh, uh, um, what is Ether's the language called? Don't you know? It's called Ether's Ethernish. Are you a tourist? <laughs> yes, I am a tourist. My name is Fran. My name is also Fran. I never seen a tourist before, and I've never seen a friend either. Welcome to Ethersta. I hope you will have fun here. Thank you so much. I have to go now. Bye. Okay. What is this? This is cute. Hello, little root. You're so cute. Yes. Oh, thank you. You're cute too. Oh. Hehe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Fran. Are you? Me? No, I'm not Fran. I'm Selma, and I'm and I want to sing all day long. Favorite song? Hey, what's your favorite song? My favorite song goes like this: one and one are two, one and two are three, two and three are five, and three and five are eight. And I don't remember any more than that. I learned that at school. It's fun. So he thirsts the thirst stands. I don't know what how are they are called. They are they they have maths too. Oh, that sounds very mathematical. I have to go now. You have a beautiful fruits, by the way. See you. Okay, let's talk to this old man. Good day, sir. Good day, little creature. I have seen flying boats, sir. How does it work? Think about them floating on water, but instead of water, it's air. It's so simple. And I could, and could I borrow one of your boats to fly away? I want to go home. Oh, go home? I see. Sadly, these boats only work with the thirst and ice. Oh, I see. Well, thank you, sir. Have fun making your boat. All right, what about you? Hello. Look at Mr. Midnight being a bloaf there. Good day, young one. What are you doing? The war is about to start and I can't see meaning in the meaningless. Uh, what do you mean? Yeah, what do you mean? Join me, young one. You'll be rewarded one, with one golden coin if you come back alive. Join you? Join you where? The game is about to begin. You are the Kamalas and I am the Valokas. Black and white as shadows and light. Is this a sort of board game, sir? Yes, a board game. Let's immerse in this adventure. You against me. Okay. I give you a coin if you win. Eh? What do you say? What are the rules? A game. First to place three of the same figures in diagonal or horizontal or vertical line wins. We toss the machinery and see who begins. Are you in? Sure. It's just like a game we used to play at school called tic-tac-toe. Oh, okay. But why would you just give me a goal if I win? Time is gold and I'm very old. I've been around a long time. I just want to have a good time. I see. Well, let's play. Okay, let's play. Uh, it's my turn. I think this will take some time, so I'll see you around when I finish. If he gives me gold every time I win, then we need the gold for something. So I, I'm gonna win a lot of it. Three hours later. Very well. Okay, I'm done. I won 
uh, it was really hard. Uh, maybe it wasn't that hard. It's just that I'm dumb. But I won. It says, what, very well done, little creature. You're a master. We, we have now... Eight golden coins. We won eight times. And it took me a lot. Anyways, let's go for the thing. The the um, clock worker. What is it? What is it? Okay. This is it. This is a very odd clock. Where are the numbers? It has symbols and colors, but it doesn't seem to show the time. Well, I guess uh, the time works differently here in Ethersta. Let's go. Oh, it sounds like something broke. <laughs> when? We broke the clock? Maybe I'm doing something wrong, but it, how does it work? I don't know, maybe I can ask for help. Okay, it's broken. We broke the clock. Let's go find the clock worker. Oh, no. Nothing. Nothing in there can help me. Mr. Clock... Sir, I have a little problem. Hmm? Yes, I don't have any. The big clock on the tree is broken. I can't make it work. Please help me. You have to help me, please fix it for me. I beg you, I have to go home. I never fix a clock for nothing. Otherwise, my life times go to waste. What do you mean? I char charge one big golden coin per clock. I knew it, we're, we're going to need the coins. Time is gold, you know. Here, sir, a golden coin. Yes, but do you have to offer me the job first, all right? Do it, and be polite. Oh, sir, clockmaker. Would you like to fix my clock? In exchange for this piece of gold and in the name of uh, time. I beg of you, accept my offer. Of course, that was an incredible job offer. Very passionate. Great, let's go to the big clock and fix it. So we wait. Mm, you were right, the clock is broken. You can fix it, right? Of course, just a second. Oh. Mm, yes, hmm, oh, there. What is it? It seems that somebody was playing a dirty game around this clock. What do you mean? It means somebody broke it. It's immoral. Breaking a defenseless clock. Oh. Why would somebody break it? Kamalas, Winter, Monte Cotram, the stones, many reasons, miss. Oh, what are you talking about? I don't understand. Kamalas, the evil darkness. They work for Remor. The terrible black. And Kamalas are the only ones allowed into this land. The only evil we have around. It wouldn't surprise me. Remor wants the stones. But what I don't understand is, for what purpose? Those stones are meaningless for him and his kingdom. And the stones are in winter time. Is Remor a giant black monster with a goat mask? A dead goat mask? Yes, you know him. Yes. I think it's because of him uh, I'm in this land. I'm a human, you know. Oh, a human. Now I understand. I also need the stones. They're on my way back home. I hope it's not too late. Aha! Uh -huh. This is why you need to go into winter time and go to Mountain Cotram. Yes, exactly. I have to talk with the great wizard and borrow the stones. Mm, well, it's fixed now. I'll give you something that will make it easy for you. Here. What is that? It's a remote control for the clock. You will be able to travel into four, all four seasons in just a quick turn. But it's just a prototype, so it may not work if you're too far away. 
And remember, time is an infinite layer reality, so be careful. I'll be careful. Thank you very much. You're a very nice cult maker guy. Please call me Cockwind. All right, Mr. Cockwind. I'm Fran, by the way. See you soon. Bye. Thank you, Mr. Cockwind. Let's go here. Let's see. Whoa, the lake water is very clear. Can I jump? No, I can't. Okay, so let's... How does it work? Alright. I'm getting the whole of this. So... The wind... The, wi the, the mountain is in winter time. We need to go... Winter time. Oh, I mean... Yeah. Oh, this everything is so cold. Oh, what is this? Oh, where are you? You look like fairy. The fairies in my books. The purest of feelings, the light of all material. We are balocas. Oh, those are the balocas. Oh, you're very shiny, and you make me feel so happy, so very happy. Look, creature. One of the young Balokas will receive the shield. Ombakma. <laughs> Pimilkro. Ombak. How do you pronounce that? Anyway, let's go. Wow. Soldier of the sun. Creature from the soil. Fruit from the sea. Let the universe illuminate you with the truth and be free! Huh? Where are you going? We continue your paths to life. May freedom be with, be with you, my friend. Oh, sir oh, or miss, mm, can you do magical things? The universe is already doing magic all the time. You're full of magic yourself. But I wish to know things. And it's odd. I feel like you know everything. We are the light. We're everywhere. What answers are you looking for? I want to know who killed my parents and why that big monster is the big monster hunting me. The truth will come to those who seek. Your path towards truth is immense. You are living in a world that turned its back to you. You are too fragile to face the truth just now and too strong to let it go. Uh, but... Dear, don't be sad. We have to keep going. What is this? Yes, kitty, you're right. What is this? What a huge Valocas is not real though. I wonder what they use it for. It has four arms. Maybe the great Valocas has four arms. Okay. Okay, we will figure this out later. I don't know what to do with it. Uh, let's go to our main mission. Very wizard, wizard is making something here. Spicy stuff, hehe, <laughs> but my stomach always get a lot of gas when I eat spicy stuff, but it's a funny feeling. I wonder what's in, in this bottle. It can be chocolate sauce or milk. 
Maybe other things like poison. You never know. I wonder what. Oh, I already read that. I see a human school. Hello, I'm not the only human he here. But maybe that human never found his way back home. I'm in big trouble. I don't understand, but I'm in another reality, so it's okay. I can waste time trying to do the thing, things I can. I should learn more about my own beautiful world. I don't, okay, I don't, I don't understand, but I recognize some of the symbols. Plus, minus, multiplication, and other things. It must be some mathematical stuff. Stuff to do magic with, I guess that's not being used. What a lovely rabbit. rabbit. I wonder if the wizard saw it. He did a good job. I'll try to do my own when I get back home. Okay, let's talk to him. Oh, are you the great wizard, sir? Sorry, I'm sir, I'm Fran and I need your help. Is this the mountain car trim? Excuse me, can't you talk? You have too many questions. That's good. The king said you help. Oh, sorry, sir. The king told me you could help me. What the king says, we do. Mm hmm. I need to, need to let me the stones to open a door to my world. The stones are missing and I don't remember where they are. Every time they seek, I hide. Every time I hide, I forget. So they can't be found. They? You mean the black shadows, sir? I just want to know the biggest answer of them all. How does the rabbit do it? I saw it once. A human did it. The rabbit came from an empty hut. How? This is the greatest question of them all. Because if nothing exists, then the nothing exists. But if the nothing exists, then there is no nothing. I wonder again. How? Sir, why don't you ask the person who did it? Oh, I have a visitor. Good day. What brings you to the great wizard? That means me. So, just so you know. Good day, sir. The king sent me here for the stones. The stones? Ah, it's been a long time since somebody came around asking for those. I made the most fantastic spell of all time so nobody could find them. You know, the black shadows, the Kamalas, they try to steal them all the time. So I have to be sure. But sir, I need the stones. This is not my home. Hmm? The stones are hiding. Only, I only remember the four riddles that are connected to the stones. Four riddles that will unblock my memory. Only when all four riddles are answered correctly, I will be able to tell you where to find the, to find five items. These items are the stones in the in their layered, layered reality. Then the only one who can bring them back is me. Oh, that's a lot of information, sir. Let me show you. Wow. This is the star of Thirsta, Om Kabe, <laughs> the greatest guide of the sky, the greatest caretaker of this land. Mm, and what do I have to do, sir? Where are the riddles? I'll give you the four riddles, written down in the language of everything. The answer is always one item. Place the items of the star of Thirsta on their respective symbol, okay? And after that, I'll be able to tell you where the stones are. Okay, now we have a new puzzle. Yay! Oh, thank you very much, Sir Wizard. Oh, Sir Wizard, the king told me that you could make me a human again. Did he? Hmm. I think that's true. I barely remember how to do it, though. You don't remember? But I can't go home like a tree. I understand, but I can't help you right now. I have to recover some of my knowledge. Perhaps we can try to make you a human again after you find the first stone. Oh, that would be incredible. Yes, incredible and great. Just try to figure out the riddles and I guess everything will be fine. 
Sir, do you need do I need something special to become a human? Hmm, I think this medal is very important, if I remember correctly. So bring me your clothes and we'll see how it goes. Okay, can you explain the readers again? I forgot what to do. Just place a uh, uh okay. Uh, when you complete that I can explain more to you. Now the rabbit science is waiting for me. Alright, I think uh, this is it. This is all the time I have for today. We'll complete uh, the rest of the um, of the puzzle and the other puzzles in the next episode. Uh, so I have to go now. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked it. I hope you had fun. Uh, this part of the game it's really fun. And and it's beautiful also the scenery they have drawn it's amazing so I'm having a lot of fun this may be my favorite part of the game maybe uh, because it lacks the suffering Fran is going through like the blood and all of that so yeah uh, thank you so much for watching please leave a like subscribe become part of this and uh, I will see you in the next episode uh, bye bye See you around. Bye.